Welcome into 12 News at 9. New tonight, the report is in after the city of Wichita hired a third party company to investigate the police department and the city manager's office. It's an investigation that your tax dollars paid for. But as Fact Finder 12 investigator Haley Tucker finds, the city is not releasing it to the public yet. And this has a city council member concerned, Haley. Rachel, yes. So this is all stemming from the nearly two year old investigation into some Wichita police officers sending inappropriate text messages. The city hired a third party to look into the police departments and the city managers handling of that investigation. The city got the final report from the company Friday. Now one council member is raising concerns on why elected officials didn't know the report was in and why they didn't receive that document. I did not know that um, whenever, whenever you had reached out to me and told me it, it, they came in. I had reached out to the city manager to um, to ask to ask for a copy of it myself. What he said? Um, he he said it was a draft copy, which um, I didn't quite uh, quite understand that. But he said that they would have to have a final copy before. I can see it right now. We don't know what's in the report. The city says the only person who has it is the assistant city manager. Sources brought concerns to fact finder saying since it's a draft, there could be changes made to the document. Blue Boss says he asked city manager Robert Layton this question. I said if it goes to a committee first before we get it, how can I ensure that there wasn't any changes? Because I'm, I'm a raw daddy guy. I like to see exactly um, what their conclusions were and try to make my own interpretations versus something being fine tuned. And he informed me if there were any changes made to the document that th those, those would be highlighted exactly what changes were made. But but I, I, again, I'm, I'm a little bit puzzled as to um, what changes we would make to that. He, he, he said maybe if a name was wrong or something like that. That's what the city says too, that changes will be made if there are technical inaccuracies. The city paid roughly 214,000 taxpayer dollars for this report. Blue Boss says it's important for the citizens of Wichita to know what's in it. We're the elected officials. We're representing the public. I hope that we're all getting the same information no matter what district we represent, whether we're the mayor, or the city council, or what area of town. We're all elected. We all represent the city. I think we should all be afforded the same information because we're, we're trying to make decisions. There is no timeline of when that report will be released to the city council members or to the public.